Hello guys, I am Nikita and welcome back to our DDS interview sprint. Today we will be tackling the clinical component of the interview process. So let's start. Simply said, once you receive an interview from a school, the clinical interview and the bench exam is a make or break deal. In our experience, candidates who are well prepared and confident about their preclinical and clinical skills are able to navigate the interview process effortlessly. The admit letter from your dream school only comes after you perform well collectively on your interview and bench exams. Having said that, let's debunk a few myths revolving around bench exams. Myth number one. If you have practiced on one Typhodon model, you will be able to ace preparations on other Typhodon models as well. Guys, this is not true. If you've already started researching about bench exams, you will know there are several different types of Typhodons, including but not limited to Kilgore, Columbia, Accidental, Frasaco, and many more. We know that these jaws are expensive, but please make sure that you practice a few times on the same Typhodon models that you would be given during your bench exam for a particular school. Our advice is start with Kilgore and then depending on what invitations you've received, you can decide which one to buy further and then practice on that. I am only stressing out on this because we know that the anatomy, including the grooves and contacts, as well as the texture while cutting these teeth differs considerably between jaws. Now let's go to myth number two. If you are not using loops, you will not clear your bench exam or you will be at a disadvantage. Guys, this is again not true. Do what you're comfortable with at the end. While it is true that loops improve your visibility and you are more likely to see how your prep looks, you can also do an excellent preparation without loops. If you've been using loops during your practice for a few months now, go for it. However, don't buy loops two weeks before your bench exam and expect that you can get used to them and perform well on your bench. It is very typical for everyone to take some time to get used to loops. The other factor is the expense. Good company loops are very expensive and you might not want to spend on it while you are already spending so much on your applications and interviews. It is all right and a normal perspective among candidates. In that case, you can also go for slightly cheaper loops which are available on Amazon, eBay, etc. So to conclude, loops are not a requirement. You can use them, you can do without them. Coming to myth number three. Enroll in a bench preparation course only after you get an invite. Guys, I will answer this from my own personal experience. Some schools hardly give you time to prepare for your bench. It could vary between a week to a month. So start early. Professional bench courses are a valuable investment. Don't wait till the last moment. Take a course or start practicing on your own if that is what you prefer as soon as you are done with your applications. The process is so competitive that I know candidates who've practiced around 600 teeth, and you will only be able to get that much practice if you start early. The other advantage of enrolling in these courses is that you make great connections. You will be meeting candidates in the same process as you, but they will have their own unique stories, all of which will make the entire experience very meaningful. You will also sometimes find mentors who will guide you through in this process and that is super important. Now let's talk about in-person bench courses versus online courses. So in-person bench courses stands out more because you know that you are getting supervised hands-on experience. However, in-person courses are sometimes expensive. So what do you do then? You can enroll in an online course. You are still going to learn a lot and have a professional critique of your preparations. It is always best to have someone who understands the US dentistry and how the US criteria works in evaluating your preps. So we at Capit Simplified have an online bench evaluation service where you can send in your prep pictures to us and professionals assess and give you feedback. 
check it out if this is something you are looking for right now. We have linked it in the description below. Stay tuned for the next video and please share, like and subscribe. Thank you.